So we're going to finish up the last three races from all over the place. The first one's up from Lingfield. It's going to be the Surrey National. It's over three miles and four furlongs. So finally, Alessa Martin Needham looking to stay on his feet. Vinnie Gerard with El Villar prompt. David Robertson's Rebecca Sledmere. Kaleidoscopic River for Martin Needham. Pedrag Hogan's Alexandra Cornwall. Sensi Utopia for Vinnie Gerard fell on first time out. John Morgan Shatara looking to finish. Agent of the Free for Pedrag Hogan. Matt Cooper's Royal Wedding. Settler for Craig Beckwith. Amorous Scarlet. Stu Gray, our favourite. Classic Chance. For Alex Cherry, Matt Cooper's Stone Cold Steve Austin, and called Jonathan also for Alex Cherry makes up 14. Another big field here. Over three miles and four furlongs. We'll clear the first of the 21 fences they'll have to take here. And it's a Shatara. Not finished your race yet. This is third outing. Gets over the second and leads by a couple from the chasing pack, which is just being nosed. Steam Stone Cold Steve Austin out wide as they get to the third. They'll clear that as well. Stick a jump, I think, in the middle there by finding Alice, who's also unseen his rider the last couple of races. Also trying to keep his jockey in the play. But Shatara's the one that leads us and opened up a four or five length advantage now from out wide Stone Cold Steve Austin. Then called Jonathan in classic chance for Alex Cherry. Followed through by the second Matt Cooper, also Royal Wedding, and then the Yellow Silks of Alexandra Cornwall. Towards the fence now is Kaleidoscopic River. Up against the fence is Il Villar Prompt. The grey just on the outside of that is Finding Alice. And then we've just got Sensi Utopia. Amara Scarlet and Rebecca Sledmere towards the rear. And Mr. Craig Craig Beckwith Settler mid pack. But with a nice 6 7 length advantage now is this Shatara for John Morgan. Looking to follow up from the, the last. Six, seven length advantage to call Jonathan classic chance to get to the fourth. Well, the steps over that our leader. Still maintains the lead. Just throw out a big thanks to Greg Clutterbuck last week. He did a lot of work to get day three sorted. Plenty of comms. He didn't have a lot of time. He also had a little paddy, as we know. And obviously I'd like to wish Alex Jerry to get well as well. He's not been too well over the past week. Josh's son's better, or his child, I'm not sure if it's his son. And also, thanks to Jim Morgan, I think, stepped up to do some race running this week as well. But anyway, back to the Surrey National, and it's this Shatara that still leads by five from Classic Chance in second. Called Jonathan Stone, called Steve Austin, the Green Silks of Villa, Villa Prompt, and the outside of that is Agent of the Three, and Free Improving. Wider still is Alexander Cornwall, and they've got Rebecca Sledmere towards the row. Amorous Scarlet and Royal Wedding as they get to the 8th. Big Grey at the back is finding Alice. Kaleidoscopic River and Senchi Utopia and Settler as they get to a small ditch. And the leader was a little bit slow over that and his lead's down to four lengths now because Classic Chance moved into second. And now Villar Prompt and Alexandra Cornwall. Stablemate Agent of the Free. And Stone Cold Steve Austin. Scarlet's improved now to sort of mid pack. I think it's the Ralph still is David Robertson's Rebecca Sledmere, and then the Grey finding Alice trying to improve along with Stablemate Kaleidoscopic River. Now the Grey a little bit wider is Sentry Utopia. Just set there for Craig Beckwith, settling at the rear. We've still got two miles to travel. And we'll know it all comes steaming towards the end as they go over the tenth. And we'll clear out slower jumps, but Shatara still maintains this lead. And clear the 11th, well, poor we'll jump there, I think, by called Jonathan, who shuffles towards the rear of the pack along with Stone Cold Steve Austin now. And go over the 12th, and it's this Shatara. Amara Scarlet, agent of the free and classic chancer, fighting out second, and length back to Villar prompt, and Alexandra Cornwall. Wedding and Century Utopia making up a bit of ground on the wide outside, and the grey finding Alex towards us here. Followed through by Rebecca Sledmere. Royal Wedding, Kaleidoscopic River. Called Jonathan Stone Cold Steve Austin a little bit on and off the bit towards the rear. And, uh, still settling for last place is Settler. As they go out for another circuit down the side of the course into the back straight now. It's the Shatara. 
by three now to Amorous Scarlet Classic Chance Agent of the Free. Now Villa Prompt and Alexandra Cornwall. As they approach the first down the back straight. Clear it. Good jump there by Agent of the Free. Puts himself into second on his own from Amorous Scarlet. Now Villa Prompt to go over the 14th. Mistakes there, I think, by. I think that was Finding Alice. The Amorous Scarlet. As they both sh shuffle back. Yeah, the 15th, they both take that better. Sattler at the rear, pecked a little bit on landing. There's a mile left to travel. In the Surrey National. And we've lost one, it's finding Alice. Has gone now, top weight for Martin Leader. Has managed to get round again. It's three in a row. Probably the glue factory for that one. But it's Shatara that still maintains the lead now as we pass the seven pole. From Classic Chance, Nil Villar Prompt, Amorous Scarlet, Wider Still, Alexandra Cornwall, then Rebecca Sledmir on Royal Wedding. Next or so back to Kaleidoscopic River and called Jonathan as they go over the 17th. They all clear that. Settler starting to improve from the rear now. Demote Stone Cold Steve Austin to the last as they go over the 18th. And it's Shatara still leading, but down to just two lengths now. We've got Alexandra Cornwall out wide. One making a real dash of it now on the wide outside is this Senchi Utopia. So it's Shatara, Alexandra Cornwall, Senchi Utopia, El Villar Prompt, Amorous Scarlet, Classic Chance and Agent of the Three. Running on well now is Settler as well. And it's Senchi Utopia that takes it up inside the final half mile from this Shatara. Led to throughout, but not now as Senchi Utopia heads in well and takes a length advantage from Shatara in second. Running out of the pack now is Rebecca Sledmere, Amorous Scarlet. We've still got three furlongs to go and two to take. And it's Senchi Utopia from Shatara. Amorous Scarlet moving still better of always Settler. But it's this Senchi Utopia. Takes him into the 19th. All clear it well. Oh, and we've got one being pulled up there. Stone Cold Steve Austin has put, done his knees. And it's Senchi Utopia. But here comes Settler as they get down to the penultimate. A little slow over it, Senchi Utopia. And that's taken up by Settler. Settler and Alexandra Corner. As Senchi Utopia goes back with Amorous Scarlet. Kaleidoscopic River as they go over the last. And it's Settler and Alexandra Corner. A wide Royal Wedding. There's a line of horses. Gladys Copy River. Classic Chance and Amorous Scarlet. But Settler has gone to the front now with half a furlong left to run. Here comes Kaleidus Copic River. But Settler from last to first takes it for great bet with wins the Southern National for good finishing Classic Chance there. I think got up for second from Kaleidus Copic River. Well done to Craig Beck with Texas Surrey National. Race, nine on, oh, race 11 on your cards. Just two more for the day. Day one of week nine. Settler takes it from Kaleidoscopic River that just hung on for second from Classic Chance in third. I think Royal Wedding got up for fourth. He did. Well done for Matt Cooper. And fifth was Agent of the Three for Patrick Hogan.